Welcome back, guys. We'll tell you about our sickness in a minute. We just re had to regrout the shower because it was separating the grout was separating into cracks on each side. I don't know why, but it was doing that. See, and we just put some more grout in there. Still got the sponge. Still got to wipe it. But in case you're new to our channel, this is our shower we did by ourselves. Pretty cool, huh? Went all the way to the ceiling too. We we'll put this glass stuff in. It's pretty cool. And this is what we did for the dam right here. See the dam? That's a good dam. That's a good looking dam. Get your humidifier back on. Uh, this happened too, guys. My starter and a wheel horse went. Check that out. It like fell apart inside. It's like trash. So I got another one coming. Forty-two dollars, guys. That's it. I got a good deal. But it's been raining forever, guys. Oh, I don't want to face it to the sun. It's been raining forever, and we're just uh, finally coming out after two weeks of hibernation. I thought that was Walmart. Heather got a sunburn with antibiotics. Check it out. Antibiotic sunburn. <laughs> I got a sunshine sunburn yesterday. It was 68, so I sat in the sun yesterday, and that was my sunburn. I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I put two more here. Green Giant and Leland Cypress. This is a small cypress though, huh? We are seriously slow. I turned that tree because everybody coming around the corner was like blinded. Oh no, another pine tree's growing. These things grow faster than you can cut them. All the stumps and stuff, I'm putting them in the foundation and burn them again so we don't have to look at this. It looks better now. Just one step at a time because we're doing it ourselves and you know after building a house, <coughs> to build a second house gets a little bit tiring so we gotta take a break. Financially and mentally, <laughs> and physically. Right. At least we're out and about, guys. That's what counts. Just the sickness has killed us. I don't know what the heck is going around, but whatever's going around, it's really, really bad. So Fred went to the grocery store, or Walmart, to pick up my medicine because I needed it right away. Now I tried to do some yoga while he was gone. That did a, did a little bit, but not so much. Not cantaloupe, honeydew melon. I don't usually buy honeydew, but I think Ross likes honeydew. I don't know. He must because I don't buy this usually. I buy what I like when I go grocery shopping, and he buys what he likes when he goes. So now we have honeydew. I don't buy apple pie when I go because somebody tells me it hurts his belly and it blows him up. So when his tummy's bothering him, that's going to be why. And we have bags of oranges because he eats like 10 of these a day. And then he wonders why his tummy hurts. And we always have apples because I love apples. He must know that. I don't know. And bananas. We always have bananas. Everybody eats bananas, right? Because once in a while you got to have a treat after you've been sick for two weeks. Yeah, but it's going to blow your tummy. I went to Walmart and I, I licked my hands and I got all the germs. <laughs> no, I, touched, I touched every single... <coughs> no, you didn't. Oh, that's a cough. I've touched every single cart my hands in my mouth trying to get a stronger immune system because that's what you guys told me to do. I was all the way over there, asked him about the pie, and forgot to ask him about the honeydew melon. <sighs> why did you buy honeydew melon? Yeah, honeydew melon's pretty good. Why, but why didn't you buy cantaloupe? Because I want a honeydew melon. It's, I've had cantaloupe for the last seven years. Melon, it tastes so good. I like honeydew melon. And then I said to him, I said, well, how about some yoga? I was like, maybe, you know, we can teach you some different poses and stuff that you, you have to use your brain and your physical well-being and your mental and use it all at one time and maybe it'll help. But he wasn't too receptive to that either. So, I don't know. I think we just have to both work on the stress aspect because when he gets stressed out, I get stressed out because we work together and we live together and everything. So, we got this at Walmart. Our many trips to Walmart. We can probably keep the lights on at Walmart right now. I have rosemary and basil, oregano, um, thyme, parsley, and lavender. That's what I've made or put in here so far. Oh, he's so beautiful. Has such pretty eyes, yes. Oh, look at those puppy dog eyes. Look at those puppy dog eyes. You guys such pretty puppy dog eyes. Hi for dinner? I lost like 15 pounds. I'm trying to get my calories back. Your stomach is going to blow up. And you're going to be telling me it hurts. Because you're eating gluten. You know, some gluten is good for you because it scrubs your veins. Oh. We got carrots, potatoes, carrots, uh, what's that orange stuff? 
sweet, sweet potato, potatoes, um, zucchini, zucchini, uh, ch grilled chicken with um, my favorite part. Fart leaves. Fart leaves. Fred, you're gonna get hurt. Your leg way up there like that over your head. Jeez, Louise. Don't put me on there, Fred. I'm serious. Okay. You got something in your hair. Yeah. You got lice. No, I don't have you lice. You got a piece of lice right here. Look. That's not lice. And shortly... Oh, I ordered the starter for the tractor. I ordered it this morning. It was 42 bucks or something. It was wicked cheap. I mean, I'm not <gasps> happy spending 42 bucks, but it's not like... It's 142 or 242 It's not bad, really. We'll talk to you tomorrow, guys. Leave some feedback. Feedback's real important. If you've seen anything in the video that you don't like, leave it in the comments below, and we'll talk to you tomorrow. See you guys.